Hi, I'm Laura Tavar from Kaisel, the American School of Lisbon, and my favorite day of the year are the Oscars. In the 2014 edition, Matthew McConaughey said, Every day, every week, every month, and every year of my life, my hero's always 10 years away. And this is a reminder that I'm the only one who can guide myself towards success, and that I can be someone else's hero too. At the age of 17, I have experienced enough to make my own movie. Waking up in an amputation room after being attacked by a barracuda, having to flee with an eight-hour notice Venezuela's regime due to political persecution, or moving to Portugal to take care of my brother while my mom was at a clinical trial for breast cancer. But what I have the most pride is not that I survived each experience, is that I have had the emotional strength to remain positive and to focus my strength in helping others who are going through the same struggles. If you are looking for me, start at the border with Spain, where I ran 10 kilometers to raise funds for oncological research, at the Czech concentration camp of Terezin, where I made a play about the health atrocities during the Holocaust alongside its survivors, or at the Hague in the Netherlands, where I led a health-centered MUN committee. Of course, that's just like every Marvel hero, I need a rest. All my friends joke about my best friend being my headphones, which constantly play songs my brother and I compose, or my drawing pencils, which always stain the pockets of my jeans. Every hero has a team, and I'm proud of mine. From winning cross-country competitions, to scoring decisive goals in a final in Spain, or attending my first karate session, I never quit. Of course, being a hero goes beyond receiving medals and standing in front of large crowds. Being a hero means that you can make others smile on their worst days, whether this is by dancing Mamma Mia late at night or being the next 007, my dream. <laughs> Everyone says my laugh is my trademark. Every day, I try to reach out to a new Vietnamese child so that they can join the health NGO I created there. And every night, I sue and I sell it back to collect money to ship medication to Venezuela. The truth is, I know that one day I will reach my goal of standing in front of the United Nations to implement healthcare for all. I know this because all of my struggles have pinpointed that this is my superhero mission. And Brown's mission is to go beyond serving our own community. It is to serve the world, to be each other's superheroes. And no matter what, that is what I will do.